All the survival techniques happen in this specially designed pool at the Navy's Aviation Water Survival Training Center. You say come in. Now the goal by the end of the day is to train you to survive this, the dunker. Where you're strapped in, flipped over, and you got to escape out a window, just like in a helicopter crash. But first, there are baby steps. You're going to hear three, two, one, ditch. At that point, you're going to sit down and you're going to grab that bar. That bar is going to be your egress bar, okay? You're going to hand over hand to the other side. It's going to be a reference point. Once you get to the other side of the device, you're going to be faced with a couple of handles. Don't let go of your reference point. That's your lifeline, all right? You're going to use your right hand to start working the handles in a clockwise motion, starting with that upper right handle. You'll work your way around. When you get to the bottom, you can switch hands and then you'll finish at the top. When you get to that very top handle, you have to turn it. grab all sides and pull yourself through, all right? Any questions on that? Here, in shallow water, we needed to crawl along the bottom, fiddle with some knobs, and then push open a window and swim through. Even though it looks simple, I have to admit that I had a few butterflies. We're wearing the flight suits and the, it looks like a helmet, the Navy calls it a cranial, and you just don't feel like you're just swimming in the neighborhood pool. Now this is my GoPro video as I'm going through. Actually, I didn't realize until I saw this video that I completely whiffed on that handle on the bottom. So be it. It was pretty easy once I figured out that I could fit through that window. Up next was this contraption where I wouldn't be so lucky.